So today is the day, walking up to the surgery center now. Uh, pretty excited, you know? Not as, uh, not as freaked out as some of the other ones I've had because I kind of know what to expect. I uh, kind of know how it's gonna go. Uh, but the doctor and I had like a 45 minute conversation yesterday, uh, just going over everything, making sure we were doing the right surgery, making sure we get in the right spot, um, just like correcting the right problem, you know? Uh, so, uh, see you guys when we get up there in the room, uh, we'll go from there and pump, man. We'll see how it goes. Said everything went well. Uh, said there was a lot of scar tissue. I'm not surprised. Yeah. yeah. Either am I. Surgery went great. Uh, we're back at uh, at Taiki's house. We're staying with Taiki when we're out here. Thank you, Taiki, for letting us stay. Um, but uh, had a few uh, crackers and water and whatever uh, to eat there when I was coming out from anesthesia. Didn't throw up. Feel pretty good now. Uh, so going to go ahead and get into a little bit heavier stuff, a little bit of apple, and then as long as I do the apple well, should be able to do this well. Uh, excited to get into this because I am starving. Uh, process recovery starts now, man. Uh, I'm ready. Cool. Uh, everything exactly as I thought it was going to go. Um, apparently, there was so much scar tissue, the guy described it as concrete. Uh, <laughs> He said that uh, it wasn't like the older nerve couldn't move at all. That's what he was saying. Really? Yeah. Damn. So did he clear the uh, scar tissue as well, along with the, the fat wrap job or whatever? Yeah, they didn't do the fat wrap job, but they did wrap they it did? in. They did wrap it in some other stuff, but there wasn't enough fat for him to use. Okay. Okay. You're getting. Am I, am I getting am I gonna get your vlog? No, it's yeah, okay. dude. Absolutely. So he was pretty confident that like that was a big issue. Um, so then he was like, yeah, your pain was probably caused from like some other branch of the ulnar nerve that just happens to still be in the area. And then fixing the ulnar nerve should fix that. So, yeah. They put it back up on top of the muscle? Yep, uh, they put it back on top and then they wrapped it, uh, not in fat, but in some other membrane. You got feeling in all your fingers? All of them. I went like this with my pinky and I was like, I was like, please, 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 yes. <laughs> I was like, let's go, dude. Because I, that's not, I didn't want to deal with that, you know. Yeah, no, no doubt. That's, I mean, that's a lot of years of crap that happens. Yeah, yeah, that would not be fun. It just feels like, hey, you had a flexor pull, and then instead of stopping throwing, I just decided to pull down five more times. Uh, that's it. <laughs> so like you tore your, you tore your flexor. Yeah, it's, it feels like I tore my flexor, and then I was like, yeah, I should keep training, and then did. Yeah. Um, Which, crazy enough, they, that's cut, exactly they, what they cut did. his flexor they in, cut half in half today, so... <laughs> Can you throw yet? <laughs> no, not quite. Yeah. It, probably tomorrow. No, yeah, okay. Yeah. Nice to you. How's Nicole doing? Is she just chilling there with you? Yeah, I'm filming oh, you. Hey. Hello. <laughs> Good job supporting him through yet another surgery. Thank you. Your wife texted me the same thing earlier. <laughs> Yeah, you're like a damn doctor. You can probably do it at this point. Oh, no. You might as well throw some scrubs on and just jump in on everyone else's surgery. So, woke up from a nap, slept for a couple hours after surgery. I got pretty good sleep last night, so not super tired right now, which is great. Um, feeling pretty back and normal. Just finished a walk as well um, after the anesthesia. Try and get it out of my system and, uh, and get back and, you know, get some blood flowing. Uh, doctor wants me just kind of moving my hand around, uh, wrist up and down, things like that. Uh, said go ahead and try and move the elbow as well. Haven't tried to flex or extend it yet. Uh, no weights, nothing like that. Just get some movement back into it. Give us some time to heal, get some blood in, into it. So that's what, uh, that's what we're doing for the next few days. Uh, we'll just be uh, trying to get to end range, uh, the range of motion, get it all warm first, go on some walks, get some blood in it, move it around, and, and that's about it. So... Uh, Here's to starting uh, step one, step one of the rehab process.